You know, I watch that college football every Saturday on my TV screen. Sipping that beer and eating in chips and rooting for my favorite team. When Sunday comes, I'm in hog heaven cause the pros play all day long. Popping tops, cussing the ref, calling plays and cheering them on. Till Saturday about a month ago, something real strange happened. Well, I was watching that Saturday game of the week when my wife came strolling through. She gave me a wink and left the room just as Texas scored on LSU. Well, the half ran out and the score was tied and I was sitting in sheer delight. When a whistle sounded right in my ear and I jumped up and boy, what a sight. There was my wife with the whistle around her neck wearing the sheer black lacy thing. Half time, she said, half time, I said, woman, what in the world do you mean? Well, she grabbed my hand and she led me away to the room at the back of the den. She closed the door and made a great pass play, made it hard to defend. She led me back and she popped me a top at the start of the second half. Had a funny little grin when she walked away and I could swear I heard her laugh. Sunday came and the pros kicked off. Two games were on the slate. An East Coast game and one in the West. And man, I could hardly wait. The Bears were seven and the Jets were ten as the gun sounded halfway through. Then a whistle sounded right in my ear and before I even looked and knew. There was my wife wearing a whistle around her neck and not another cotton picking thing. Half time she said, half time I said, I think I know what you mean. Well, she grabbed my hand and she led me away to the room at the back of the den. She closed the door and made a great pass play, made it hard to defend. She led me back and she popped me a top at the start of the second half. Had a funny little grin as she walked away and I could swear I heard her laugh. Well, up till now, the football season has always been too short. But it seems the women have reinvented what they called an age-old sport. The only way to make it through the season for all us football freaks Let's keep it a secret, don't tell them boys about the Monday night game of the week.